Exactly this issue also was evolved in MKUltra. Need help, you're not alone. Uh, hi there. We are reaching out because members of a YouTube community, including fellow creators, viewers of staff, have expressed concern for your safety or well-being after coming across content you posted with the topics related to suicide or self-harm. Well, the thing is, I never posted any topics related to me, related to a suicide or self-harm. Uh, the video was published, titled even as Father threatened me during MKUltra with a suicide he would commit. That's clear. At night, in case I would, I would not bow his, well, police demands. Uh, for this issue here, it was psychiatrist Peter Kops. It was a Slovenian police who insisted me, soon after this one here, you will get psychiatric assistance. So that means the one who clicked this issue uh, in respect to video, which doesn't have any connection with my causing myself a self-harm or with a suicidal thinking, is yet another position, another incident Slovenian police created. Obviously, they filed against me some sort of complaint, something uh, that instigates on something that have no reality, anything whatsoever to do with me. And, but was copy-paste from MKUltra Brainwash. It was presented to me during MKUltra uh, by the psychiatrist Peter Kapsch. Not on one occasion, but on many occasions, also involving the police about self-harm, committing myself. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, trying to irritate, disturb, intimidate. This stuff happened, that's true, uh, two days ago, on July the 3rd, 2024. I don't think I'm the type that gives an impression that I'm committing a suicide or self-harming myself. Um, I'm not really shy of visits to the police station. So... If I would have this kind of thoughts, I don't think I would be doing any of the stuff I do. I don't know how the hell they interpreted that stuff. That's like really, really gutsy. That's like really, really daring to inform the community about it. It's daring enough for me that I will actually go ahead and I will contact the YouTube about it and ask about who exactly did filed such issue against me because if you watch the video absolutely has nothing to do with me and even the title here it states that when it comes to the suicide it was my father who threatened me during mk ultra would commit a suicide at night in case i wouldn't bow his police demands this is related to the feeding tube he is at the home for elderly people now this is the this is this is this is related to the issue known as a feeding tube attached to the stomach, which police claimed during torture at home for elderly pe uh, people, father had connected one. Uh, I don't know, maybe since 2008, something like this, it was about the feeding tube, if not even 2005. I don't know how long they talked about the feeding tube, that he's got connected a feeding tube to his stomach. So... Torture happens. I'm sure that you understand what the torture is. The MK Ultra, you may not recognize, you may not admit that recognize that MK Ultra exists. Yeah, it fucking exists, actually. It exists. Not that it existed that Bill Clinton tried to lie about, that it was some uh, cases of MK Ultra. I, I think there's a video about that he posted about unethical experiments, which I don't think it even refers to MKUltra as unethical. I think he's referring to some other issues about unethical. But MKUltra, you, you, can, you can see one whichever way you see it. It's so fucking bad that government, even today in 2024, would not take responsibility for it and exclaim that it actually existed 
and in fact it exists even as i as we speak about this stuff yeah, that's a sh that's a funny one that's a really stupid and look at that it's it's no reply okay so that i should reach out to the forum uh guys please uh, google also times go ahead browse my blog a little bit get familiarized with exactly what i'm talking about when it comes to mk ultra this is a proven case this is not about whether the case existed or did not exist or whatever it is numerous people being identified with buildings police investigators police officers police department entire construction of the police department all kinds of stuff the white house um was that camp david uh, Windsor Castle, you fucking name it, everything identified, proven. Um, you're welcome to visit the Ausa Times, join me. And I'm going to post you this video and ask the YouTubers, actually YouTube, Google, to please give me, to furnish me with information about who exactly have filed complaint against me. Uh, with idea, obviously, to irritate, intimidate disturb disrupt work help center and so it goes into the help center let's see this help online let's see this stuff here i don't have a problem with going and visiting um help.com i'm looking for uh, always good attorneys confidential support from helpline or hotline near you online checked or phone helplines in slovenia using a helpline what to expect really i had no idea this stuff even existed international association for suicide prevention lifeline free emotional support anywhere ah <laughs> uh, yeah 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 uh, i am working on getting police a police escort to the prison literally i'm not interested in any kind of suicides you don't have to worry about me i'm doing just fine i'm doing great and for others that are around me is being taken care of very well extremely well i'm doing my best to help them as much as i can So I really, really need to know who the hell filed this against me. What exactly this is all about. And I would demand from the Google, from the YouTube to learn about who exactly filed that from me. Um, I don't think that just anybody should have the right, the ability to just click the button and state something like this anonymously. I think that you should have, in fact, a Google account to post something to flag the video. Uh, you should have verified your Google account with a telephone number and stuff so that you could do stuff like this. You can't just go and do this stuff like that. If anyone can do this kind of stuff, then I have a problem also with the YouTube, with the Google. So this stuff here should not even be difficult to learn about about who dared to do this stuff to me never had any kind of suicidal thoughts to the degree that I would well obviously proceed and take myself life and I have gone through a whole lot I have been subjected to MK Ultra torture beginning the age one and this is not MK Ultra, this is not about MK Ultra torture, but it's about a different kind of MK Ultra torture being used literally for extermination purposes for the genocide. So I managed to withstand psychiatrists, Slovenian police, for no less than 51 years. I think that now when the case is resolved, and I expect the outcome against police against psychiatrists 
I don't see why the fuck I would, after 51 years of this, why would I go and search for the suicide as a solution to this stuff? I don't understand any of it. After gathering all, doing all this stuff to do something, piece of art as I created, that I would go and search for the suicide, you must be out of your fucking mind. It doesn't even cross my mind anything related to the suicide. Anything related to the suicide. That's insane. 